Hey guys, Clay Cards here, coming to you with a preview of a PSA submission I'm about to send in. Uh, this is a personal order. Uh, all the stuff pictured here is mine. Uh, I'm going to send it in this week. Um, a lot of Series 1, uh, a lot of football, optic, a ton of optic basketball. Uh, so yeah, we'll we'll dig right in here. Um, starting off with some 2020 Series 1. Uh, Harper Rainbow Foil. Uh, honestly, I think Harper's a little bit underpriced. And the picture on this, uh, I think, could actually provide us some value. Uh, it's, a, it's a pretty good picture, Philly's uniform. Uh, so we'll see what happens with this one. Um, Again, even if it's a, a $30 card uh, as a PSA 10, it's, you know, an increase over the 2 or $3 raw value. So, uh, Davers, uh, short print, working out. They haven't come out with all the terminology for the short prints yet. You know, you, ha you have, like, the, the Acuna bat downs and, you know, that kind of stuff. But they haven't come out with the terminology for this yet, so... We're going to call it getting swole, the getting swole short print. Uh, Otani Gold, so this is out of 2020. Uh, three Alvarez's, three Alvarez rookies. And again, uh, if you watched my 2020 uh, tops break, uh, opened a 10 and a uh, hanger pack. Um you can kind of see my my opinion on how these will grade um the series one stuff looks to be a lot easier than the uh, series two and the update stuff from last year so we'll see if that holds true but you can get some more uh, some more details on my thoughts on that in the uh in the other video uh horner we got one two three four five six of these six horners uh biggio uh, again, the only reason this is going is because it's a gold. Um, hot rookie last year uh, out of 2020. So, see how that does. Uh, we got four Aquinos. Uh, Cincinnati Red, being from Ohio. Got to root for them. So, four of those. And then I actually pulled the short print as well. Uh, flexing, I suppose. Uh, short print there. Maybe in the dugout. I'm not sure what they'll call those. Uh, two Bichettes. Bo Bichette rookies. A Austin Riley uh, purple. These come from Tar... Not Target. Um, Meyer. Meyer. Uh, purple short prints are from Meyer. So Austin Riley purple. Again, these are pretty short printed and usually pretty tough grades. I uh, thought this one looked good. A uh, big time rookie last year, so we'll give it a shot. Trout, always great in trout. Uh, Tatis, this is a short print as well. Um, again, big rookie last year, short print, gonna grade it. Uh, two Gavin Lux cards, an Aquino Turkey Red, and then an Aquino Chrome Turkey Red. Uh, these are both from. Uh, series 1, 2020 still, but these turkey red inserts are some of my favorites from this year. So, uh, Trout, two of those, turkey red. Alvarez, Gavin Lux. Uh, Alvarez, this is like a blue bordered uh, insert. Top's Choice insert. And then a Trout insert as well. Top's choice again. We'll always grade trout. Uh, Vlad, uh, missing number. These have gone up a lot recently. Wish I would have uh, gotten this earlier in Sunday a long time ago, but it is what it is. And then I bought a bunch of Hura as well. Um, just bought a lot of these on eBay. These are tough grades. So I bought like 30 of them. And this is all I had. I had eight. Yeah, eight that were gradable. 
out of the 30. So we'll see how those do. These this update stuff is tough. The corners are typically terrible, and this dark edge here, chips. It's it's all bad, but hopefully for the best on those. So that's it for the baseball. Um, this is all football. That's all football. So we'll go through the football next. Uh, Prism first. Uh, Brady, red, white, and blue. See what team he ends up on. Could be an interesting offseason. Uh, pair of Kyler Murray. Prism base. And a Kyler Murray camo auto out of 25. Uh, this was a BGS 859. Um, it got an 8 centering. Uh, which I'm not, not feeling on this one. The 8 centering. Um, I expect it to 9. Uh, the, the auto does go off the sticker here. So no sense in grading the auto. Um, I expect it to nine, but again, a nine will be a big improvement on a eight, five, nine at BGS. So hoping for the best, expecting a nine. So, uh, Daniel Jones base four Haskins base, Drew Locke base, Easton stick. I'm sending in three of these, um, Kind of ex seeing maybe he'll start this year. Uh, maybe the Chargers will give him a shot with uh, Rivers leaving. So I thought I'd better grab or get a few of these graded before the season. Maybe get some preseason hype going and see how those do. Uh, Gardner, Prism rookie. Uh, two Kyler Murray Optic rookies. These have been tough grades this year as well. I've got two of them that look good, but I've got another you know, six or eight that do not. So, uh, Kyler Murray hollow, Kyler Murray red out of 99. I'm expecting, uh, expecting this one to nine. Um, hoping for the best. There is a small flaw on it, uh, on the side here, hoping for the best, but expecting a nine but thought it was close enough that it's worth a shot. So, And then I've got an Aqua as well. That one's out of $2.99. Uh, Montgomery. A lot of expectations going into the year. Didn't quite perform, but it looks like he'll have a, uh, continue to have the opportunity in the next year. Uh, these scope parallels look really good as well. So this one's out of 79 Nick Bosa, Defensive Player of the Year. Uh, grabbed a couple selects early. Didn't end up breaking any of this, but grabbed all four of these off of eBay uh, pretty quickly. Buy it now. Uh, Tom Brady, uh, field level silver. Uh, field levels are kind of what I'm after. Uh, they're going to be the shortest printed. Um, that The shortest printed that aren't numbered. Um, so Brady, silver. Daniel Jones, base. Gen Daniel Jones, silver. And a Josh Jacobs silver. I see the field, the field level on the back here. So if you're looking through any select, see the field level. Uh, Obsidian, David Montgomery. Got this on a deal off of Facebook. Uh, just like the card, like the Obsidian cards. And this one looks like a pretty good candidate for creating. Uh, a lot of these get off center left to right. But this one's pretty good. So, uh, Josh Allen, Prism, Base. Lamar Jackson prison base expecting this to nine uh, but there is a price uh, increase on the nines so go ahead and get that slabbed uh, two I'm uh, PC pieces actually a uh, blue wave car out of 99 last one 99 of 99 uh, have nearly a completed prism rainbow uh, of car uh, missing the one on one, but uh, nice PC piece here. Got a couple of these. Uh, not sure if I've got a 10 or not, so hopefully, this one gems and we can hang on to it, add it to the PC. And then this one's actually one that I'm retrying. Uh, this was a PSA 9. Um, 
I think this card looks great. Uh, I was honestly surprised it didn't 10 last time. These are really tough grades because the foil surface on these scratch really easily. But this one looks great. Um, bought this off eBay at auction. Uh, came in, couldn't believe how good it looked because it gets a lot of, a lot of surface scratches uh, vertically here a lot of times. Um, but this one, I mean, there's nothing on the surface at all. It looks great. Um, centering looks pretty good. It's a touch off. I'm wondering if that's what they got it for uh, last time. But everything looks really good on this uh, championship contenders ticket out of 49. So try that again, hoping for the best there. And then we move on to the basketball. Uh, let's see, right there. So Anthony Davis, I picked this up off Facebook. Uh, this is out of 10 out of 10 uh, newest newest Laker well not the newest Laker anymore but uh, Laker so hoping uh, the Lakers can make a run this goes up in value we'll grade it uh, Michael Porter Jr. Hollow uh, planning on holding on to Porter into next year and kind of seeing if the uh, Nuggets get him some more playing time looks like he's you know capable just can't get it uh, can't get on the floor so we will see a uh, pair of Zion Donruss rookies. Got a great Zion. Uh, RJ Donruss rookie. Uh, Kyrie Irving Fanatics. Uh, these Fanatics are out of 100. Um, this one looks pretty good. Centering on this 2019 Prism stuff has been brutal. Uh, I'm sure a lot of you guys are aware, but it's been brutal. So this one looks pretty good. Uh, I like the green with the green jersey, the Celtics jersey, even though... <laughs> says Nets. Um, just like the look of the card. Not sure how well it's going to sell, especially uh, with Kyrie not being in favor for most people. So, eh, we'll see. Uh, Kobe White variation. Guys come on hot recently. A couple 30-point games. So, uh, Dumboya. Got three of these. Uh, these came out of my, you know, prism box as I opened prism, threw them in a box. Um, and then all of a sudden you've got a uh, guy who's uh, shown some flashes. So we'll send him in. Uh, Kiki, this was a uh, Facebook purchase as well. Uh, most of it came in a lot. So this was part of the lot. Uh, Well-centered, out of 75, rookie. So we'll see if he can uh, end up doing anything. Uh, a couple Brandon Clarks. Three Brandon Clarks. Kevin Porter Jr., guy who's coming on pretty strong for the Cavs recently. Claxton, I think he has some potential. Um, gonna get a silver graded. Gonna avoid the base for now, but we'll go with the silver. Uh, Thibel, guy I really like. Uh, got to see him in person um, not that long ago uh, in New York. I uh, think he... He looks pretty good. He looks like a like a real real good player. So uh, see if he can develop a little more offensively. But he's going to be on the floor with uh, how well he plays defense. Uh, him and Simmons are an interesting combination. So see how that plays out. Uh, hyped insert. Get hyped insert with LeBron. Get hyped insert of Giannis. And then two Kobe NBA finalists. R.I.P. And then the rest of this is actually optic basketball. Um, ended up busting a decent amount of this. Um, and a lot of it looks pretty good to grade. So we'll run through some of this. Uh, the Fanatic set that I busted uh, is in here as well. So uh, winner stays LeBron. Got to grade LeBron. Got a great Giannis, uh, T minus. Uh, T minus insert of Curry. This is like the purple, purple uh, parallel. And then a T minus of Harden. Uh, wouldn't grade this normally, but it is blue out of 85. So figure Harden out of 85 ought to do okay. So uh, Kobe White, my house. Love the my house inserts. Love them. These things look great. 
So big fan of these. Might end up trying to grab some more off of eBay or, or uh, purchase them elsewhere, but gotta gonna have to look for some more of these. Love the way they look. So my house, Kobe White, uh, Trey Young, purple, LeBron, Luca, and Giannis, and then a Fantasy Stars Curry refractor, hollow, hollows for optic. Fantasy Stars Giannis, Fantasy Stars Anthony Davis, thought I'd grade this uh, in his Laker uniform, not a ton of Laker uniform stuff out there yet, so get that one slabbed, and a LeBron Fantasy Stars, Fantasy Stars inserts look good too, but the, uh, the My House inserts are to die for. I could not stop pulling LeBrons. Couldn't stop. I didn't bust very much optic, but I couldn't stop pulling LeBrons. So I got a blue velocity, a purple, and a hollow. Um, obviously not upset about it, but it was unbelievable. I didn't break that much optic. I mean, it was, you know, 10 or 15 cellos and uh, and the retail box that, that I broke... Uh, uh, recorded and posted on YouTube, so didn't break that much, but couldn't stop pulling LeBron. So blue velocity, a purple, and a hollow. The hollow is nice. The hollow is in really good shape. Uh, the purple's in really good shape. Uh, really surprised. Uh, the purples last year were really tough grades. Uh, the edges just weren't clean. Uh, a lot of fuzz. A lot of you know, just not in good shape. And then a blue velocity as well. So. Um, Hoping for the best on these. Good picture for, of LeBron there. So, uh, Trey Young, blue velocity. Trey Young, purple. Kawhi. I thought I'd get the Kawhi graded. Uh, again, it's one of those first cards in his Clippers uniform. Uh, base and a blue velocity. So I figure if uh, they end up going far, maybe making it to the finals. If he goes back to back on two separate teams. Uh, as the leader of two separate teams, uh, gotta think his prices uh, increase substantially. So, go with those two. Getting to the point where uh, Luca's kind of trending toward LeBron, where you just gotta grade it. If you got a Luca, you just gotta grade it. So, we're kind of inching towards there. So, I'm gonna try to get ahead of the game, and we'll grade a optic base, Luca. Uh, Harden Hollow. Again, wouldn't normally grade Harden, but it's a hollow. Um, you know, we'll see. The hollows were pretty hot last year. We'll see how they do this year. And then get into some rookies. Uh, Zion, only pulled one Zion and looked good. So, send her on. Uh, Cam Reddish base and a Cam Reddish purple. DeAndre Hunter base. Kendrick Nunn, uh, no name. They're all no names, so... An eye out for those. Tyler Hero, Kobe White, Kevin Porter Jr. Purple, RJ Barrett, and Thibel. A guy most people probably wouldn't grade Thibel, but I really like the guy. Uh, we'll see how he ends up uh, performing, but I like the guy. So, And then this is all stuff I'm grading from Fanatics. Um, there were some stuff that... Uh, you know, under under closer after closer inspection, uh, wasn't worth uh, grading. I didn't think uh, surface surface issues, a uh, couple centerings, but nothing. You know, most of it that I wanted to grade was gradable. Um, Tatum, Fanatics Blue Wave. I'm gonna grade more of the. I'm trying to tell myself to grade more of the. Uh, more of the big name. Uh, star players um, especially when you get numbered and stuff like that I mean this is probably a buck or two raw and you know if it's 25 30 bucks as a PSA 10 it's worth it um, so you know I'm trying to tell myself get myself to grade more of these more of these cards like this um, it's uh, a little bit uh, 
taxing because then you gotta, you know, list them and, you know, ship them and all that, but I uh, think this is gonna be worth it in the long run. Um, I'm also not overly confident that PSA uh, isn't gonna raise prices substantially next year, so I'm trying to get as much graded this year as I can, um, just in, in preparation for, for some changes. We'll see, but preparing, right? Uh, Tatum Fanatics, Curry Fanatics, Giannis Fanatics, Lillard Fanatics, Anthony Davis Fanatics, Lakers uniform, Luca, Kawhi, Trey Young, Ben Simmons, Devin Booker, Durant, Derek Rose, and Shea. Uh, these are kind of iffy for me. Uh, Derek Rose has a lot of fans, a lot of following, so shouldn't be a, a big issue there. Uh, Shea is, I think he's on the edge. Um, the, if if he had a ton of, if he was a rookie for Oklahoma City, I wouldn't grade it. But there's not a lot of, I'm not even sure if there's any rookie cards of him in an Oklahoma City uniform. Um so I'm gonna go ahead and get the the OKC Uni slabbed. Uh, that one's that one's pretty borderline, but willing to willing to do it. Uh, grading the green Melly. Uh, it's green, and um, I've watched some Pelicans games. He has some skill. Uh, you know. I think if he wasn't playing with Zion, there's no way I'd grade it. But I think playing with Zion, he might get some some watches. You know, more people watching his games. You know, he scores 21 game. Somebody buys it, you know. So, go with that. Uh, Brandon Clark Fanatics. Hunter Fanatics. English Brad Zingas uh, Fanatics. Uh, Knicks. Obviously, with the Knicks, if he does anything, you know. Get some attention. Culver, Rui, Kendrick Nunn, Romeo Langford, Ja, Gafford, Zion, Hero, Cameron Johnson, Jackson Hayes, Garland, Nasir Little, Pascal, and RJ. So there were a few uh, that I wanted to grade that just didn't, I just couldn't condition-wise. Um, not a ton though. The Fanatic set uh, for what I for what I wanted to grade out of it was pretty good. Um, most of the issues were, were surface related, a couple centerings, but pretty good overall. So uh, this is all gonna go to PSA this week. Um, once I get it back, I will uh, plan on doing a uh, a reveal video of how the how the grades went. Um, so hopefully we uh, come back here in a, in a few months with uh, with a lot of tens. Uh, appreciate you guys taking the time to watch this. Uh, as always, you can find my information, contact information uh, in the description below. Uh, if there's any questions, uh, feel free to reach out. Thanks, guys.